Hey guys, this is G-Man, and I want to show you my newest 3D printer. I just finished building this the other day, and I'm finally getting consistently good prints on it. So this is a Delta 3D printer. It's specifically the, the Rostock printer. I built it because uh, I chose this design, because I feel like I can make it easily, since it uses a lot of plywood parts. But uh, here it is. This printer is really tall. Mm -hmm. I, the build volume is, is 20 centimeters by 20 centimeters and it can print things 40 centimeters tall so that, mm -hmm. that's twice as tall as my other printer can do and it uses a really unique design it operates using three towers and three arms to move this the, the print head around mm -hmm. and then uh, the, print, the heat bed is uh, always stationary on the ground so anyway, over here I have the the extruder, and it uses a Bowden tube to feed the the plastic into the nozzle. This is just your regular uh, Greg's extruder, and I haven't made a, a. Eventually, I'm gonna make a spool holder for this spool holder, and it'll be uh, right there. But I haven't gone around doing that yet. So anyway, uh, here's what it, here's it is right now. I'm using the Alu Hotten V5 for it because I, I I got it for a cheap price, and it is it is years ahead of the J head. It has a 0.3 millimeter nozzle uh, diameter, and it's it's really uh, high quality and high resolution. I'm really loving it. I, as you see, I got a fan on it to keep it a little cooler. And here are some uh, prints I did. The white ones I printed on my first printer and these the orange ones I printed on the one I just did now and they look bas mm -hmm. basically exactly the same which is a uh, which is a good thing they both look good and right now I'm printing an octopus but this one's a little different because I'm printing it at mm -hmm. 0.1 millimeter layer height and that is the smallest basically any printer can print so, and it's looking pretty good so far mm -hmm. it's got a little more done but this, yeah, this thing is really high high resolution because this is the highest resolution I can print something, and it's coming out great. So yeah, I've got the an LCD screen here, so I can control it with an SD card. It's better than using a better than controlling it with a computer. So yeah, anyway, yeah, um, that's my 3D printer. It's uh, I still got a lot to learn about it, but I'm loving it. Thanks for watching.